approach. Geralt! The villain. What the fuck are you doing here, you old whore son? Neveln is a mixture of a boar, a bear, and a human. A fire for my guests. He has magical abilities, and he is a kind, funny, and secretive kind of guy. <laughs> right! You gonna tell me what happened to you? That's a tale requiring wine. He ended up in a situation that got him cursed, and that's why he looks like he does. Getting into the physical side of Nivell was a long process. It really feels like a collaboration between so many people to make Nivell. This is the before moment. Got it? <laughs> because I have never played in full prosthetics before. Barry Gower and his amazing team made a full cast of my body and they made the suit upon that. So it fitted me as a hand in the glove. It was like directly made on me, you can say. I felt like I could express myself. Mm. This is when I started I doing ballet. <laughs> <laughs> I had a great time working with my movement coach, Paul, and we studied uh, boars and bears and, and tried to figure out like, how do they move? Look at that. We try to find this animalistic but still gentlemanish movements because Nivellen is a gentleman. You look lovely. And he's an entertainer and he's a, he's a, he's a showman. Uh, roast venison, say that was a paradox we enjoyed playing with. I love that we did it for real, you know. The only thing that is CGI is the face because I didn't manage to make my face look like a boar. I try though. I had an opening in the mask with the camera to capture my facial expressions. So that made it real when it came to playing with the other actors because then I, I had eye contact. Oh. So it's one of the most interesting things I've ever done because it felt like a, <laughs> a true transformation. What's it like being alone because of what you are? It's what eats you alive. Loneliness.